Hey there everyone, welcome to another episode of this uh, Master of Orion. Unfortunately, I did have a crash uh, when I was fighting actually this fleet. Because I picked, I already sent a bug report actually, but then everything started to to have a problem because, you know, because of what happened, you know, the game just frozen and couldn't cycle into uh, another position, you know guys. Um, so I had to go, go back actually at some point. Uh, can you imagine all the menus stacking up uh, in between? You know, I was watching a battle and then I was suddenly on the production screen. So it was really difficult. Uh, I couldn't even load up the game. I had to restart the game. Uh, but I did send a bug report, so hopefully they will get it. This is still in early access, so it's kind of normal that it, that it will happen like that. Um, and it's still it's working perfectly after um, the... The bug report uh, after uh, sorry not the bug report after I um, I loaded up. Um, what I wanted to say so I did actually I already uh, know some information. For instance, the humans are around here. You know that's Sol if I'm not mistaken. And we're gonna find them out as soon as I arrive there. So that's cool. Um, let's move all our ships. Um, some other stuff I do know that this Lomar 2 is gonna get really high in uh, pollution. It's gonna get two turns there, so that's fine. Then we're gonna get it out of the pollution, of course. Right, there we go, the humans. The humans will be quite Greetings, friendly, friend. which is good. I am the president of the human republic. May the cooperation between our races be ever fruitful. That's nice, humans. Very Star Trekky. Right, let's talk to them because they're they're the only ones actually that are still not mad at me, you know. All of them are quite mad at me. Yeah. Population eighteen, troops thirteen, that's nice. Troops nine, these guys, let's hear them. Hello, friend. Speak your mind, friend. Let's share shards. Propose. Gladly. I didn't start the, the other mind, time friend. around with that. I started with the embassy. Uh, then I went Speak into a trade mind, treaty, and Speak then I went into a non-aggression pact, and they took I it. Trust so they're quite, for a friend. yeah, they're Farewell. quite friendly here, which is good. Uh, I got the xenobiotics, which means a toxic processor. I desperately need of this. Right now, here's what I thought. I thought on advanced fusion and advanced engineering, because both of them are into you know, better ships. So I can develop, you know, and start worrying a little bit. This is a small campaign, let's say, let's say. You know, this is a small one, because it's only five, it's a small galaxy. So there won't be enough time to go through all the re the, the research or anything. Um, what should I need? I, sh I do need this, because we're having big levels of pollution. Because this prime is grown, let's go over here. Yeah, I'm maximizing production as much as I can. Yep. And let's see, let's move everything. And right now, you're gonna move over there. That's it. I do know that there's gonna be some problems. Yep. There we go. Colony that is becoming polluted. It is increasing on two percent. I don't know how. Right, so let's just choose production. I can clean up the production, the pollution quite up, or I could build the toxic processor. Completely cleans the atmosphere on toxic planets and upgrades them to barren. This is a toxic planet. No, it's a tundra. Right, so it's going to be on four turns. I think I think actually what I need is just to clean up a little bit. You know? That'll be important, okay. Right, the blockade was broken, and right now I need to attack. And I'm not gonna do too much. I'm gonna go tactical. But it did it did crash on this, so I'm not gonna do any actions. He can do everything by himself. Uh, which is kind of bad, which means that if I click on something, then it won't be as good. Right, let's just go through this. 
let's watch this instead of cinematics let me just watch it like this you know because when I click the anti-missile rockets it immediately did what I what it shouldn't it crashed good that was the damage so just the missiles deal with these guys look the beam did eight and there we go one victory that was good press any key to continue Good, very well, very well. Let's close it up. Uh, let's choose production here. Now this is a toxic biome, so we should be able to build the toxic processor and fix it to barren. That way it might help out a lot. Look at that, minus 39%. Amazing. Fleet needs orders. Where? Oh, hi there. Now you may notice that there's the humans. Yeah, I'm just gonna do like this. This guy is just gonna explore over there to. Oh, it cannot. Now let's try and go into there. There we go. There's the military outpost. I like the military outposts. You know, just to control the the areas. It's quite cool. Let's go next turn. Let's see what what was this the progress on Lomar Two. The mineral classification of a Cylon planet has oh, been upgraded. Oh, nice. That's good. And now the state of the galaxy. Current ranking of space fleet. Wow. Ranking on a, a fleet strength. The Bolrathi are second? Amazing. I thought they were the worst ones. Right, that's good. So, Oshiat 3 is now a beautiful, rich planet. That's great. That's great. It's going to be even better with a Neutron Collider. So, that one is going to be producing fleets all the way, baby. So, what do we, th what do we have here? Pollution. It's fine. Uh, I think for now, this is a Tundra. I think for now I can actually go just for the Neutron Collider. Yes. Yeah, let's go. Done. And the cloning center completed at Pegasus Prime. Let's go for it. This is an added one. Let's go into Neutron Collider. I prefer the production to be the higher. You know, let's check out which fleet needs orders. This one. Uh, this destroyer should go... well... I think it should go here, just to protect. I'm gonna have some upgrades next. Um, as soon as I get all those discoveries, which will be one of them is next turn. Hang on a second guys, just so I, you know, I gotta blow my nose. Right, sorry about that, guys. Oh, let's choose a research. Good, time to update everything. Yeah, let's, let's upgrade all. Good, let's choose a research. Let's go for advanced engineering. That way I can get the cruisers. Alright, choose a production. Good. Let's go Atmospheric Renewer, if I'm not mistaken, it's what I need here. Yeah, there's some pollution. Mentor 2 has grown. That's good. That's good. Now I could get... Oh! Just one change and I got one extra turn. That's nice. Let's move all my fleets. Let's go into next turn. Good. And I'm gonna have that military was there. That's nice. You did that. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Could have the military outpost there. Yeah, I think that's it. You know, just to control a little bit there. Let's move everything. Fleet needs orders. That will be this one. Well, yeah, it cannot move. All right. Let's let's put it on auto explore. Right, and now let's next turn.
Good. As soon as I have cruisers, then we're going to start going into mass production. Now, I could have grown in, in what, six turns, yeah. Let me see what I can do. Fungal farms, that's good. Move all fleets, and let's go next turn. As soon as I have advanced engineering, we're going to spend some time building up better, better fleets. Um, over here... Yeah, I'm going to need the hydroponic uh, farm. Neutron Collider. Good. I think I'm going to need the pollution stuff. Yeah, probably. And Toxic Processor build up on Menta. That's nice. So I think I should pollution, you know, clean up. Or, yeah, I think I should for a little while. You know, just to clear up that little bit of pollution. Let me just check out on Lomar. Wow, it's minus 9%. That actually, you know, makes it good so that you can change it up really fast. Let's go next turn. Oh, there's a, a fleet here. That's That appears to be just a scout. Yeah, the space factory. Let's build up a military outpost. Thank you. That's it. Let's move and choose a research. I got it. Okay, let's update my blueprint for the Tritanian armor. Let's upgrade all for now. Let's choose a research. Something that will provide super allies. What is this? Heavy armor and reinforced hull. Fighter base. It allows to carry sh it, it allows to carry fighters, small fighters on on my ships. Um, and better pods allows to. Oh, it adds equipment space without increasing the whole size. Hmm. This is one of the most interesting ones. If I add, if I get this one, I'll need other stuff. So for now, I think the best one. All right. I think for now. I'm gonna go with private funding because I need some stuff to build up or genetic mutations. Yeah, terraforming. So let's go for it. Good science. Done. Atmospheric renewer. Good. Good, good, good. I can get the space elevator. Let's build up on the better ones, on the rich planets. Uh, Sheard has grown. He's, it's the rich. Fascia Prime. It's ultra rich, so this guy really needs that. That's fine. And a new ship design has been discovered. Alright, so let's go into ship design right now. And let's get on the, the cruiser. So the cruiser has the best armor available. That's good. Yep, done. The drive is the fusion drive. You know, it's better one. Actually, shields does have some shields, good, and the computer does have a better computer than usual. Right, that's cool. <laughs> Alternate cruiser. Nah, I prefer the base cruiser. Theme design A, design B, design C. Let me see the differences between them. Oh, it doesn't allow me to see the difference between them. Right, now we get. Design C, Design B, Design A. Let's go with Design A, or none. Well, let's go with Design A. Now, the Mass Driver and the Neutron Blaster. That's what it has. Total military power. The Soul Cruiser is better than the, the whole fleet that I had. Let's go with Specials, right here. Augmented Engines, increases ships into stealth, and combat can be activated for that. Generous men get plus confused both weapon target and missile gun is into effect. There's a high chance of missiles and torpedoes target to ship to go astray. Go. Right, so I'm gonna reduce here. Let's clear. Done. And the mass drivers, let's clear them. Done. Right, that's good. For now, that means that I have a lot of space available. I could get the ECM jammer. Done. It does cost a little bit and has some space. Now, in. in in terms of weapons, let me see. 
So is that the attack? Total DPS 0 0.75. You can see the mass driver has a one of two. Uh, the Merkley missile has a lot of them. That's good. I don't like the nuclear bomb. I don't need the nuclear bomb for now. Uh, I think having the nuclear missile, the Merkley missiles, is good. Heavily armored warheads to survive. Right, reduce the chance. Fast. Separate from each person moments before multiplying the damage done. So MIRV will provide better. Uh, let me see. Can I enhance them with all? Yes, I can. But that will be a lot of. That would be costly. So I don't need this. I just need them to go faster and hit them before they hit me. I think that's good. And it will get me even more damage there. Let's have something like three missiles. Three Merkelit missiles. And let's have some mass drivers. Yeah. Facing any. That's good. Actually facing front. I don't want point defense. I want continuous fire. Auto fire. No, heavy mount. Heavy mount, that's exactly what I want. I want like three of those or four of those. Three of those at least. Yep, let's go with that. You can see because of the space, look at that. Look at the space. And I'm gonna have some neutron blasters with continuous fire so that they are more precise. Alright. Actually, instead of that, let's just have more of the same. Oh, I have two of these, and maybe I can get, you know, some laser for point defense. Exactly. Good. So, this is a good one. It does have nice total military power. Yeah, that's good. Done. Done. That's the cruiser design. Now the frigate or the destroyer seven. The destroyer seven has four mass drivers, a nuclear bomb, some Merkley missiles, a neutron blaster, and it has some anti-missile rockets. I love it. I love it. I love it. I actually like this one. It has a good military power. That's good. Done. You know the other one has. The, I like to have missiles because you've seen how effective they are. Um, so that's why I changed it a little bit there. Right guys, that'll be it for today. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys on the next episode. Cheers!